As the health care fight continues to rage on both ends of Pennsylvania Avenue, President Obama scored a win today when the Senate voted down funding for a new F-22 plane that many people say is a bad idea. President Obama called it today an inexcusable waste of money. Senator John McCain also opposes the funding and the Pentagon opposes the funding. But many lawmakers I still believe it should be there and there's going to be a fight on the House side. But this was a first victory for the president on this issue. He said that he really wants to reform it defense contracting. But the big story remains health care. The president right now is huddling with some key negotiators on the House Energy and Commerce Committee who are dealing with their version of the health care bill. There are three bills that are coming out of the House and a few bills coming out of the Senate. Uh, he's huddling with them trying to get some kind of agreement. He made another statement saying that, you know, all of this tossing back and forth about whether the bill will be given to them in August, as congressional leaders now say is probably not possible, or later in the year, really isn't going to matter. He said when history looks back and judges health care reform, which he's confident will get done because it's so important, he said that history will not be judging how soon it got done or whether there were delays or missed deadlines. So uh, the president remains forceful on this. This is uh, somebody from CBS News actually calculated. It is nine statements on health care in nine days, and he will continue that when he speaks at a press conference Wednesday night. Um, but also on tap for tomorrow, uh, Prime Minister Al Maliki from Iraq will be coming and meeting with the president talking about his strategy for the troop withdrawal there. Thanks very much. Check WashingtonTimes.com for updates as always, and have a great day.